What's happening, people? And once again, welcome back to youtube.com forward slash Cubcam TV for this, another edition of Cub Reacts as we continue to explore the latest new musical flavor worldwide. We are back inside the building once again, and I am very, very excited to be jumping into this one. Uh, United have literally just won a Europa League a pre round of 16 game against Barcelona, and I'm over the moon. I'm energized, which means I want to film some reactions. Now, um, it is approaching midnight here in the UK, which means there's going to be loads of new music dropping. I did notice that I missed this one last week. The official video for Zina Liski's Yan 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 uh, single. And we're going to check it out now. Very excited to do so. As always, friends, if you are new to the channel and you're enjoying the content we are putting together, do make sure you are getting involved by hitting that subscribe button on the right-hand side of the page. Of course, turning notifications on as well, making sure you're leaving a like, leaving a comment, and all of that good stuff. Again, uh, it's been a little while since we reacted to a Zina Liski tune, so let's get into this one right about now. And it's a TG video. Poor Before this goes anywhere, I'll apologize. I completely missed this one. I'm not quite sure how. Um, I'm subscribed to Zina Liski on YouTube. I didn't see this video pop up anywhere. I didn't see it pop up in my recommended or anything along those lines. So my apologies. Um, I, as I've, you've probably heard, um, if you've been watching the videos, I've started a new job recently. So I'm just trying to get my bearings while still doing this YouTube stuff. We're still uploading twice a day. So it's, we're, we're still doing okay. Um, but with that, um, I'm occasionally going to miss a tune. So if there's one you want to see, make sure you are leaving it in the comment section down below. Ask now my dreams I'm living up Now that they find us like one plus for Pinoc Where they they chop and my Pinoc They be like Zinono go kill us Save us It's a very bizarre intro Oh me yeah 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 Oh I'm sorry for the banana Oh I fell up in mama wow I'm out too long my father wow I can't shout Cause you the most sorry to Santana so it has a really nice kind of shimmer and shine to it, this one. Really, really clean vocal approach from Zina Liski again. Um, I won't lie, it took me a little second there to find where the rhythm was um, because obviously it's a kind of stripped back, this Marlian music approach to production. Um, unless you're hearing like a definitive start point, um, it's a little easy to get lost because you are constantly shuffling left and right. Um, but again, Zeno arriving with a real amount of swagger as he always does. Just his kind of very electronic take on vocal procedure works really cleanly. That... Constantly moving his vocals up and down. He's rising and falling. Really, really clean, man. I have a wild statement to make. I love my tears on power. Can anybody buy for a concord? I love my tears on power. So... Not because of Zena Liski, but take this as a statement. If Drake was to make an Alma piano tune, this is what it would sound like. Um, bear with me. Let me explain. Um, the use of those piano lines, the sort of unpredictable, the unpredictableness of those piano lines, for some reason, just conjures up Drake doing, um, I don't know, like dance music or dance or music. He loves those kind of off-key pianos that just kind of throw you from side to side. They kind of sharpen you, and then they kind of disappear. They're like cliff-edge pianos. Um, you then add that to this, which... Um, in general is really interesting as an overall arrangement um you add that to the, the sort of shuffling drum textures and again that big sort of very apparent 808 down below the log drum really pounding away i reckon this is the sort of instrumental drake would use for an hour piano tune maybe that's just me though let me know your thoughts this uh this set is really cool uh, just as a video i love things like this where people go to town and just make a simple room look cool i don't know whether this is a place that existed beforehand i just think this looks really cool um also zina liski on this tune that that's so catchy that's going to be stuck in my head for the rest of the evening um and i've got other reactions to film as well but really clean from zina man definitely not his best um i think it's fair to say i think he's had bigger bangers than this um and again that rhythm is a little bit confusing the second you lose it but as an overall piece, it is solid. Definitely another big one for his catalog. <laughs> 
It's mad. I don't know many vocalists that can utilize the electronic vocal sound as much as Zeno does without it sounding overbearing. I think he's in actually quite a unique bracket with what he does. There are obviously other vocalists that use that electronic kind of tint with what they do, but I feel like Zeno is almost like the party next door of this kind of sound, especially on the Marlene Music wave, because he just has this constantly electrified vocal sound, and it's almost like the inflections. It's almost like the humanism behind the electronic effect that gives it that unique edge, just like the little kind of vocal twitches and stutters and stammers like that constant fluctuation in um in both the dynamic range and the pitch i think that's what gives it its charm man really interesting <laughs> There we go, T.G. Amore doing what T.G. Amore does best, turning very colourful sets into visual masterpieces. Really, really clean piece of work from T.G. on this one. Um, again, an interesting tune from Zina Liski, I think. Um, would I put this in my top five Zina Liski tunes? Probably not. Um, is it a tune that I will listen to in the dance? Yes. Is it a tune that I will listen to on a day-to-day? For the time being, yes. I don't know. It's difficult to play Zeno tunes because he has such a unique style. You can't really say all of his tunes sound the same, but you can definitely always say they are a clear, they are a Zinaliski tune, if that makes sense. Like, he has this natural kind of absorbing factor about his music, and every single time he releases something new, you just know instantaneously what it's gonna, where it's going to go. So, yeah, an interesting one, guys. Let me know your thoughts in the comment section down below. I'm always keen to hear what you think about the tracks we review um again this is a shorter tune as well only two minutes 13 for me that's always a bit like nah you could have made it longer you could have taken it somewhere else but i do get with Zeno that he likes to keep things short and snappy that's just the way um that he likes to work um on top of that very very interesting as an overall piece uh, i love the video approach i love what tg's done with it but yeah overall uh not my favorite but solid so there we go guys let me know your thoughts in the comment section down below and as always if you are new to the channel do make sure you are getting involved by hitting that subscribe button on the right hand side of the page of course turning notifications on as well leaving a like leaving a comment and all of that good stuff and we shall see you all next time peace make sure you subscribe to the youtube channel right now corp camp tv stay locked